when you love something so much and you practice it so much, you kind of find a zone of comfort that you get in. And when I'm on the court, I feel like I achieved that. It's a really intense game. You know, it's a lot of scoring. So uh, it gives you a thrill as a fan, of course. But um, playing wise, like it's just an outlet for me, you know, get away from everything outside of uh, in, well, in real life. I think if we keep staying focused and keep listening to coach and, and paying attention and being attentive to details, you know, the success is going to come. As long as we play hard for each other, you know, execute our game plan that our coaches have, you know, placed in for us, I think we'll be perfectly fine. We are playing Georgia State, and this is a in-state rivalry game, so we got to get the dub. It's a great opportunity for us to get back on the right track. So as long as we lock in and start with this game right here, you know, we can do anything. Alex Holt, um, junior transfer here at Mercer. Outside of the basketball court necessarily, I'm like, you know, I'm real to myself, you know, real laid back dude. Um, love to get to know new people. Um, but on the basketball court, you know, I try to be that, you know, energy player that, um, you know, gives the team something, you know, hype us up a little bit more um, when we need it most. My name is Caleb Hunter. I'm from Detroit, Michigan. My dad used to play in the NBA, so I've been around basketball my whole life. It's a very big passion of mine, something I love doing. When I was little, um, I was actually like a big showboater when I was like a little kid, you know, watching uh, all the NBA players celebrate after they scored. I would do it every time I scored. I want to say my first memory was when I was in a camp in second grade, I believe. I had a great game. I hit a game winner, and I just remember um, just taking my jersey off and throwing it up in the air. I was definitely nervous before games, like, a lot. But um, as I've gotten older, I've kind of gotten over it. But I mean, it's a surreal feeling. Like, now I get more of an adrenaline rush and I'm ready to go once I see people sitting in the stands that um, come to watch us play. But um, it's definitely a surreal feeling, for sure. I love basketball because it just, it, it's, a, it's a safe place for me. and. You know, when I'm playing, it's just somewhere I can go to express myself without verbally expressing myself. So it's kind of therapeutic and something that's just always been a part of my life. This season's going pretty well. I think um, we started off kind of slow, of course. We have, what, eight new players out of like the 13 possible scholarship players. So, you know, it's definitely a learning curve in there. You know, we got to get to know each other and what everybody's good at, you know, what we can expect from, um, different players night in and night out. So, you know, of course we started off slow, but I think the, um, there's better days on the horizon for sure. I think all of our team, I think we just get along so well. And, you know, I've never been with a team where we could be in the middle of an intense game and we can look over at each other and laugh and still um, just have that com sense of camaraderie and um, brotherhood. I feel like our team has a special ability to make you know everybody feel at home you know we're all from different places like we have international players from like Senegal we have people from all around the country the United States but and we didn't know each other when we got here but as soon as I got here during the summer um everybody I felt like I was at home like I had a new family already I felt completely comfortable with everybody we just get along so well so I think we have that special ability to just know create a um tight-knit unit very fast Let's go, let's go, let's go.